34th America's Cup, race 19, September 25th, 2013, Emirates Team New Zealand versus Oracle Team USA, a John Novice video. This race is sudden death. Whoever wins this race wins the cup. Here are the boats in the pre-start. Our winds are 17 to 21 knots, and the tide is a flood. New Zealand had the uh, start advantage and has used it well to push Oracle to the west. Here's the timer counting down to the start. Boats powering up. There's the start, and good acceleration by both boats. Oracle pops up on foils very quickly. New Zealand is skimming nicely, though. Speed looks roughly the same. Will New Zealand be able to hold its start advantage at the reach mark? Here it is. Yes! It pushes again, pushes Oracle away from the reach mark and starts its turn. Very aggressive. Nice move. Let's see what kind of a difference that results in. Whoops, didn't quite get their turn completed there. They lost a little bit of ground, but still our differential will be seven seconds. So good advantage at the reach mark. Let's see what they can do downwind or if Oracle can close it up. They're both boats jibing away to the northeast, heading down toward Alcatraz Island. Very close racing here. Real exciting to watch. We're on the south side of the race course looking north. Now here are both boats down near Alcatraz Island. We're looking to the east now. Oracle jives first. Well, it's very close. And then Emirates Team New Zealand. So still a very close race. We can see that there's not much separating the two boats. It's a drag race downwind toward the leeward gate marks to the east. We're now looking straight east toward the leeward gate marks. And there the boats are it's still very, very close. Now they're lining up for their respective uh, marks. Emirates Team New Zealand is going around the north gate. Oracle's going around the south gate, a split. The differential is only three seconds, so Oracle's closed it up a little bit, and it's going to be really interesting to see who controls the cross. We can't see because it's behind this little point of land, but Emirates Team New Zealand does win the first cross, coming from the favored side. Here's a second cross in that same area. Now Oracle has taken the lead. Let's see if New Zealand can jump back in again, but she can't. So Oracle has held the cross the second time. There's New Zealand foiling to windward, trying to put some speed in there to get close to Oracle, but Oracle again crosses easily. We're still looking toward the east here, but the boats are getting a lot closer to us. Oracle wins another cross there. Both boats foiling. There's Oracle foiling upwind, really putting on a burst of speed. Oracle seems a bit more stable in her foiling. New Zealand is up and down a little bit more. And here they are with Alcatraz Island in the distance, an Oracle coming down toward us with New Zealand foiling past behind her. Oracle well ahead. There's a nice roll tack near us. Oracle's now heading toward the northwest, going up toward the windward gate mark for the last time. And there's Emirates Team New Zealand. She's tacked back, coming back to the south shore. Both boats working the south shore because that gives them tide relief. There's New Zealand up on her foil going into her tack. Whoa, very spectacular turn. There comes the dagger board up on the near side, settling into her upwind. Let's see how that's positioned her relative to Oracle Team USA. Unfortunately for Emirates Team New Zealand, she's well behind here. We can see that Oracle is tacked over on the starboard tack, and now she's all the way up at the gate marks going around the north gate, which is the favored gate in uh, a flood tide. There's Emirates Team New Zealand underneath her, and she's going to take the south gate, so that's going to cost her some tide advantage. The differential, 26 seconds, so still a boat race, but she has a lot to overcome downwind, and this is the deciding race. There's Oracle up on foils coming downwind, getting close to us. It's Marin County in the background. But we can see that Emirates Team New Zealand has fallen fairly far behind Oracle. And it doesn't look like she's going to be able to make up that distance. There they are now heading, now heading toward the east. This is toward the last leeward mark of this Emirates Cup series. Oracle still holding a pretty commanding lead over Emirates Team New Zealand. Oracle now heading for the last leeward gate. And she's now around it and heading for the finish to win the America's Cup, the 34th America's Cup. Here comes Emmer's Team New Zealand to the last leeward mark. She rounds it with 39 second differential. And the finish differential is 44 seconds. 
a class act as Amherst Team New Zealand. She put on a great challenge, a lot to be proud of. Thank you all for watching. That's the end of my America's Cup coverage. This has been a John Navis video.